What's going on guys, Sal here, and today I'm bringing you guys a video of Destiny, and if you don't know, there was a new patch, um, 1.2.0, I wanted to say that nicely and clearly so I don't mix it up, because I thought, I, I always say 1.02 something, whatever. That patch was, um, getting ready for the House of Wolves, that's launching on May 19th. If you haven't seen, I'm pretty sure most of you already noticed that the Queen's Emissary is back, she came back with new bounties, and if you don't know what the new bounties are, I'm doing one of them right now now it's basically like a public event where um, on different planets you gotta wait between 10 to 15 minutes in certain locations where a public event like this that you'll see me doing right now sort of happens it's not like the normal public events that we know of that the dark uh, the sky goes dark and um, all these monsters come in it's similar you'll see that it's similar that monsters drop in from the ship and you just got to kill them and there's waves of these monsters that come constantly and I, I believe it's 45 I'm, don't quote me on that I'm just guessing it's 45 waves and when they come you just got to wait for the final one where it contains the boss he has a yellow name of course he's the one and they do drop these rocket launcher type of things which is cool i thought these were exotic guns when i first actually saw previews of it but they're just for this um bounty that you do and some of the fallen people have it and they're really cool now there's a tactic you can't hold on to the um gun for too long you gotta constantly drop it and pick it up so it doesn't disappear you want to save your ammo you don't want to use it up on all the normal monsters that come through the waves wait for the final boss and then use it all on him makes life so much easier and i made the biggest mistake of using them up in the beginning because i got so excited so wait for them use them in a way where you need to um just save them for the boss and he dies pretty fast if other than that if you don't want to use it um it does take a while to kill the boss but i want to share a tips and tricks type of thing with you at the end of killing the boss that you'll see me killing the yellow one we're all killing him right now um, I don't know where it is in the video but you'll see him we're blasting with the rockets once he dies you'll see at the bottom left corner um, something pops up that looks like a ring, uh, key sorry I was gonna say a ring but something that looks like a key that pops up and it blinks it gives you a timer that timer shows you that there's a chest that spawns and you'll see us getting the chest right now this unlocks so many things for you it gives you synthesis of material for the planet that you're on and uh, it gives you a bunch of them and it also gives you rare engrams and sometimes legendary as well so a lot of people do get them but yeah i haven't had a chance to get them and one more thing you have a chance of it the chest has a chance of dropping and which are those keys these keys will unlock prison of elders uh treasure room and all that stuff and these keys you should collect and save them and they're just giving you a chance to get ready for the house of wolves dlc that comes out and these keys are important they play a big part in the prison of elders so you want to hold on to them you can only carry five keys so you want to store the rest um uh, store every five and then just have a fresh batch the tips that I wanted to share with you is basically when the chest spawns, the, the timer pops up and you want to look for it. They can spawn in six different places in the same area that you're in, but they can be anywhere in that location. You want to keep your eyes open and it's easier if you do it with a friend because you have more eyes, the better. So you have an easier chance to spot the chest. When you do spot it, go get it and then you'll notice that a lot of people are doing this where they'll get on their spare and they'll go to a different location what they do is basically they go to another area you'll see us going to uh, this different part of the map and it the name pops up on the bottom left corner what that does is it resets the chest you can quickly go back when the name pops up in a different location and you're away from the location where the chest is you want to pop on your um, stay on your sparrow go back the other way where the chest was and quickly make make your way to the chest so you can pick it up again depending on where the chest spawns you have a chance of getting it at least for sure twice depending on how far the gaps are in between the locations again you got to be in a separate location the name has to pop up that means chest will restock on its supplies whatever you want to call it but you want to quickly make your way back depending on location you're in um you can at least do it three times if not twice twice for sure again i've done it on most of the planets um twice is the most you'll ever do unless i think it was on um earth Skywatch where it's pretty far away distance from different locations so it won't it'll take you a long time to go back and forth to uh, gather the chest and uh, reset the area so that is the trick you'll see us doing it in this one the bounties require you to kill the monsters twice in the same planet and one was the first area you just saw and then this is the second area where the wolves spawn and you can kill the second boss and finish your second bounty there are some locations where it's so close to a different um, whole area of the map where you can do it three times times at least so um it, trust me it's a good way to get legendary ingrams and uh increases your chance of getting the keys that are really important again i don't know if this is a glitch 
it might be a glitch they might patch it on tuesday so you want to take advantage of this because i know majority of the people on this game right now are doing the same thing and i don't want any of my subscribers or viewers who are into destiny and play this game to uh lack in any um way so i'm providing you this with with the information that i have so thank you for watching i hope you guys enjoyed the video please leave a like if it was helpful and subscribe for more and i will see you guys very soon peace out